Now let's see what are the different types of data type in C sharp. So in C sharp, we have two types of data type, value type and reference type. For the value type, we can categorize into built-in type and the user defined type. And built-in type, we have byte, sort, integer, long, float, double, decimal, char and the boolean. So all these types will fall into the category of built-in type and enum and the stack will be the part of the user defined type. Same with the reference type, we can categorize into two types, built-in type and the user defined type. So in built-in type, we have dynamic, object and the string. So these are the built-in reference type. And for the user defined, we have class, interface, delegate and array. So these will be the user defined type in the C sharp. And, and these user defined type will be of a reference type. Now let's discuss about the value type. A value type variable is store the actual value. And that value will be stored in a stack. And value types are derived from the system dot value type class. So if you are talking about the value type, so value type always would be stored in a stack. Because in memory, we have two things. We have a stack and we have the heap. Let's understand with the example. Let's say we have two numbers here. Num1 type is integer and the num2 type is double. And both are value type. So if you are talking about the memory representation for these two variables. So let's say the num1 memory address is 1002 and the num2 memory address is let's say 1010. So in this stack, they are going to be stored as given in this diagram. Next is here reference type. So a reference type variable is stores a reference to the actual value means where your value will be stored. That value reference will be contained by the reference type. So you can say a reference type contains a pointer to another memory location that holds the actual value and reference types are stored in a heap so reference type always stored in a heap they never store in the stack now let's understand the reference type with the help of example in this example i am to i am taking two variable num1 and the string and here num1 is integer type so obviously it will be your value type and we have a string so a string is a reference type and if you will look into the these two variables memory representation, so this will be like this way. So num1 is a value type, so it will be the part of the stack, but the string is a reference type. So reference type value will be stored in a heap. So you can see in the diagram, we have hello in the heap, and this hello value have the memory address 2004. So this 2004 address will be contained by the str stack because in the stack we will have the reference to our actual value so that reference will be here to send 4 so you can see the reference type always going to store in the heap and that reference will be contained in the stack when your program is going to be executed so these are the differences between the value type and the reference type and how these represented in the memory I have shown with the help of the diagram. Thank you.